Morning everyone. It's the 15th of April, which is, I believe it's Monday. Starting to get lost up in the dates. Uh, today was supposed to be a, a break day, but I decided to do a little bit of vlogging today. I'm gonna go book the tour for tomorrow. So first off, I'm gonna go to, I've seen a coffee shops just around the corner from us. Uh, I'm gonna go get a coffee, some pastry or something. And then we'll walk over in the old town, book the tour for tomorrow and see what else we get up to. There's a few things I have in mind that we can do. We're still on uh, my list of things to check out while we're here. So first off, we're gonna go and get a coffee. This one, Gloria Jean's Coffee. Let's see. Hello. Coffee uh, Americano uh, for here. Uh, medium. Medium. Glass cup or take a cup? Glass cup. And can I have one of these uh, cottage cheese croissants? Cottage cheese, okay. Yep. Natto? That's it. Once medium Americano and one cottage cheese. Hot, hot. Okay. Uh, Cottage cheese, hot or cold? Uh, cold. Okay. How much? Uh, nine minutes or 40 coins. <coughs> okay. Thank you. <coughs> you will have for order? Name for order. And Mick. Mick. M-I-C-K. Which number called? Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Alrighty. <laughs> Sit right outside. Nice view. Nice chairs. So it's nine mana something, so ten mana. So five euros roughly for a cheese croissant and a medium americano. Okay, so this is my cheese croissant and coffee for five five euros basically. Uh, Gloria Jane's free Wi-Fi, so I'm just gonna chill out. And then we'll head off towards to get the uh, booking for tomorrow's adventure. Okay, the croissant was really, really tasty. Um, hard to eat with all the uh, icing sugar on it and that, just to keep clean and that, but it was very good. Like, it was, uh, it was like a cheese Kurdish type filling in it and sweet and warm and it was lovely. And the coffee was great too. Now we're walking into the old city again. Here's the old wall. I think the uh, tour place should be just on the other side of this, around there, so. Just wanted to show the entrance into the wall. Beautiful little place. All right, let's go try to find this uh, tour place and book the, uh, the tour for tomorrow. I like the way the, the big flower drums are, or the Tree drums actually are all decorated. It's really nice cobblestone. Here's an interesting little restaurant here. We should be getting close. That's a nice looking hotel. Right in the old city. Probably be pretty expensive. It's very beautiful around here. I know I'm saying that a lot. Hand on heart, actually mean it. It's really nice. Look at this place. Wow. I'm gonna stop up here and take a look at my map. I'll see where that Turkish, or the uh, Azerbaijan flag is, if that's it. If not, I'll look in my map again. Oh. Look at that, that's nice, eh? Wow. Very well decorated door. And here's my tour here. So we'll go in and book this. Look at that. The wheel looks like it's going to fall off on the uh, cannon there, but it's 
half well there. Alrighty. So, um, just go in here and book it, is that it? Yeah, <coughs> very beautiful tattoos. Ah, thank you. Okay, so that's all booked in for tomorrow morning then. Um, it's the whole tour. Uh, you get a lunch included. Uh, there's a lot of stops actually. We go to see the first oil rig. We get to go to the first mosque in Baku. Uh, we're going to go to an old place where they have uh, hieroglyphics in the walls and stuff. And we go to the mud mountain where they have a like a, it's like a like a mud volcano that you can actually touch and stuff. We'll see that, and then we're gonna also go to the the um, the fire the fire mountains, and then come back here. There is a night tour uh, booked as uh, you get included as well, but I'm not gonna take it because it's all the places I've seen already, the Venice and uh, and all that. So we've already seen all those things. So you know, I'll probably be full enough after that. So we meet right here in front of the office, the MT my tour. So we're here tomorrow morning at 9 a.m. And then we get started on the day of adventure. So looking forward to that, hope you are. I was walking by and I saw this souvenir place. So I'm looking for maybe a peak cap. Oh yeah, there's a lot of little stuff in here. So yes, these are 10 minute, which is like five euro. Very good. Where are you from? Ireland. Oh. Yes. Um, yeah, so I seem to like that one. Uh, see what else we have here while we're walking around. May as well. Traditional bags. Yes. How much are bags like this? Like this one, 15, one five. 15 minutes? Yeah, one five. Okay. Well, for today, first customer, I say it's good price. <laughs> oh, very good. Um, let me take a look and see what I can get. I give you permission, this is oil painting. Oil painting there? Yes. I have one artist who makes oil, petrol. Petrol I only have a backpack here. I don't know if I'd be able to take it back with me. I have scarf, this camel wood. Yeah, my, my partner bought one, two of them yesterday, well, yesterday there. How much are they, just? 15 half, 10 half is different. This is 15 miles, came in with 15. But okay. Azerbaijan, see? Yeah. And oh, here's some more hats yeah. here. And I give you 10 manatees for you. Oh. I have my clothes. And it's adjustable, yeah. Hmm. Let's see if it fits my mug. I have a big head. Oh no, it's okay. It's adjustable. Yeah, I'll take. I think I'll take this for sure. I like this one. I'm gonna take that. Um, so I also want something for the white cabinet. Um, and a car fares and quality just look. Quality. Oh well, that's nice. It's on the carpet Azerbaijan famous. Yeah, I was in the carpet museum yesterday. Traditional tea glass. Yeah, I don't know if it'd make the trip though. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, this is traditional 
Car- yeah. carpet style and the gross, yani yeah. government design. And you said this is a 15, eh? Yes, yes. And this good quality. Okay. What if I got two and the hat? How much? Two that is and that is a uh, 12 first customer. Yeah, this 15, 15, 30, okay. and this is 10, 40. 40. Is there any special deal? It is your price, special price. Special price. First what, customer. What's the special price? 38. 38? Yes. 38. Yeah, let's go ahead. I'll do that. Huh? Yeah. 38. Yeah. And how much are these little hats? Which one? Like these ones. This is five. Five? Yes. Wait. I have different color, different design. This one, this is for men. See, have here also many. Have color is. Oh yeah. Traditional color: blue, green, red. And these are five, is yes. it? Yes. Um, Does it fit? <laughs> nice. Yeah? Yes. For you it's better. Okay, I'll take that one. Yeah. Get the money out. Well, thank you very thank much. Thank you very much. Thank you. So, that was 53. Um, gave him 55. Just because he, you know, he did give me a discount, but I gave him the full price anyways. Um, so the shop is just on the same street as you go to the uh, my tour office. Um, very reasonable. So I got two bags, one for Shauna, one for Kira. And I got the um, the peak cap because I, I actually liked it. And black because it stays cleaner. And then I got the traditional hat as well. So happy days. Now go throw this back in the room and continue on. I'm going to right by the Fountain Square again. We're gonna meet Emily here at two o'clock and then we're gonna go somewhere for, to one of the restaurants I have pre-selected before coming here. I'm gonna see what that's like. Right now I just picked up a Bison drinks. It was 150, which is basically 80 cents. I'm gonna give it a shot. It looks like a Red Bull. I'm gonna go sit on the bench, give it a shot, see what it's like. Let's give Bison a shot. exactly like Red Bull exactly so not bad for 80 cents look at all these kids and some the kids playing with them <laughs> we're in just up from the, uh, the fountain you have to turn right and then left so we're but it's all like pedestrianized walking areas you see as far as you can see, really neat. So it's, it's, it's pleasant just to walk around and there's tons of different shops. Oh, there's tons, tons of pigeons. Look at them all. And here's a little bear. Three Bears Pub, that's what it's for. Well, I'm gonna turn it off now until I see something a little bit later. I uh, spotted this place here on one of side streets. Look at the pastries. I might get a tea. Just a tea and soup. Look at what she's cooking right on the skillet. Hello. Hello. There's all the back of us. Wow. Look at that. Chocolate back of that. Wow. Hello. Um, can I have a tea? Tea, sir. Tea, 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 tea
Monty. Be the natural. Tiny. 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 Okay. One. One. Yeah. Okay, do I pay here or pay outside? or? Je n'ai pas sweet, hein? Sweet? Je n'ai pas. Sweet pachlava. Yeah. Pachlava. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Tout, tout le qui est Azerbaïdjan pachlava. Um, okay, I'll try one of these. Yeah. One kilogram. Just one. Uh, I just want to have tea outside. One passport. I just want to Yeah. Take away. No, I just want to sit there. Tea. Ah, yeah. Okay. Just tea, and then I'll try it. Okay. Ah, there it is. Turkish, yes. No way. Mix one, one, two, two. Just one. One. Just one. Just okay. Yeah. Mix one. Yeah. Mix one. Yes. Okay. And tea. And tea. Okay. 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 Pay there? No, no. Pay hey, Sit down, please. Okay. Okay. So that was a little difficult with the, uh, the language there, barrier. Uh, but uh, I think I ordered more than I wanted. But anyways, baklava doesn't go bad. And we'll have the chai. Now I, I have to get a pot of chai. Uh, tea. So... I'll see that and see how it goes. We'll just put it, wait for it to come. It's arrived. There's some uh, music going. So here's the tea with the back of us. And then we'll pour this. I have time to kill anyway. So I'm going to tuck into these, see what they're like. Give this one a try. Oh, very thick. Very good. try this one. I think I've had this one before. This is the traditional Azerbaijani uh, baklava. Mm. I'm going to try this one. Very rich. And I'm finally doing a small one here. Very dense. Very good chairs here to sit in with the cushions around it so you just sit back and enjoy your tea and the baklava while you're sitting there while on holidays exploring a new city where else would you rather be well that was very good that's about the most baklava I've ever ate, sat and ate in one sitting, four pieces. Uh, it's a ton of calories, I'm going to have to walk off today, but very good. Okay, so finished the tea, I had about three glasses out of it. It's a full thing that they sell. Um, I ate a little bit more than I wanted to, For I just wanted to have a cup of tea. But I ended up having the four baklavas and a full pot. So I was 25 minot, which is roughly 13 euros. But if you had a baklava back home, you're probably paying about three or four euros per one. So I was 12 right there and then a pot of tea. So it's value in that, but it's a really nice shop. It, they had all sorts of like food items too. And if they go in the back in the corner, there was all seats so you could sit down and eat. And it was really, really nice. Like the food that for to sit down and eat was like fabulous. Like I'd definitely go there again. Now it reminds me. I forgot to uh, tell you a story yesterday. When we're at the restaurant after the um, after the gondolas in the mini Venice, one of the waiters he was looking at my arms because of my my tattoos there, and he was like he came to me he said he started counting the barbs you know he said oh and he had to get a friend one of the workers to translate that he was wondering where my, my the meaning of the tattoos and that I said oh, I just like the because he and he showed up his one he has one he had a little barbed wire wrapped around on a tattoo and it had four barbs in it he said in Azerbaijan each barb represents one year in prison so he looked at mine and he saw my barbs he thought I'd been in forever so it's funny different cultures have different meanings in that so I didn't know that so maybe that's why when people see me looking like especially the policemen and that they look you walk by with your tattoos and that they they say oh Interesting little side fact. Now I'll just keep walking on. Like it's a beautiful little street around it. It looks like something's way down there. It's a 
funny shaped building. We'll make our way down that way. So that building at the end of this road that I saw from far back, it's the theater. Azerbaijan theater, so. Theater lounge, let's see what's this. This is a nice old building here. I wonder if it's being repaired, look. Uh, the ballet theater up, so it's a ballet house. Can't really get to it because it's all under construction. It's too bad. Looks like a really nice building up there. Yeah. And I don't think there's much further that way. So we'll just head back. Or wait, let's take a look quick. What's at the end of this building? It's what it actually looks like if uh, we didn't have the facade in front. At least it shows you what it looks like visiting. Very nice old building. So they're in restoration of it. And then we're walking at the end of the here. I don't know what this building is. Looks like another government building. And there's something over there as well. Let's take a look at that and then we'll head back to the fountain. It's going to be getting close to 2 o'clock to meet up. There's a statue up there statue there as well. Yeah. Looks like another theater of some sort. So your man in front's probably an actor or something like that. Yeah, it's another yeah, main theater. And then this is a nice old building too. Sultan Mohammed very nice. Okay, so we're gonna make our way back that way. 